Good morning, everyone. It's Monday. We all know what that means. It's time for the work week top and bottom of the deck reading. Oh, this is Faith from Firesign Tarot. I hope everyone's having a spectacular day. I'm whipped. It was a long weekend. You guys probably noticed you didn't hear from me at all. Ugh. I apologize. I got the new lawnmower on Saturday. That was a two evening event because my lawn was really, really bad. Oh, but you know, when you haven't had a lawnmower in four years and you've just been weed whacking it a couple times every summer to try to knock it down. Anyway, enough about me. We're talking about you. All right. For those of you who are new here and don't know how we do this, we go by the elements. It's Gemini season, so air will go first, water, fire, earth, around the wheel like that. If you don't know where your sun sign falls in the elements, I'll shout them out as I go. It's just like any general zodiac sign reading. If it resonates, cool. If it doesn't, might not be your story. Stay through to the end. Watch your moon, ri moon rising or Venus sign readings if you aren't sure what those are. There's plenty of places on the internet where you can put in the information, like date of birth, time, place, pops out your natal chart, pretty easy to read, I think, find out lots of cool, interesting things about yourself, keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid, all things can and maybe vice versa, might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher, same as a general zodiac sign reading. I just go by the elements because, well, it makes it go a little bit faster, usually. If I went, you know, sign by sign with this, I'd be here all morning, and I just don't have time for that because I have to leave for my job in a half hour, so. All right. Uh, Gemini. Ugh, air signs. <laughs> Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I've had three swallows of coffee, bear with me. Okay, one shuffle and a cut. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, what's going on this week? Hmm, excellent. Four of Swords and the Six of Wands. laying something to rest, possibly finally out of a state of heartbreak, and wow, that six of wands can either be finding victory or it can indicate a return, okay? In the past, the tower and the five of pentacles in the reverse, oh wow. Sudden and abrupt change, a little bit of a shake up. Calamity. It could have been something as mundane as the car breaking down. It could literally mean that the house came tumbling down around you. You know, take it however it resonates. But it was sudden. And it changed everything. Five of Pentacles in the reverse. <sighs> It can indicate coming out of the cold, or it can indicate ghosting. We will we'll get a clarifier on that real, real quick. Fast forward a little bit. Two of Wands in the reverse, and just having a Pentacles. Standing at the crossroads, not quite sure what you want to do. Being patient, it's like... Not being able to let go of the past and move forward, but you're riding it out. You're, you're waiting. You're in a state of waiting. It's almost like a, if I do this, if, if I move forward, I'll never know what would have happened. Okay. Why would you do that to yourself? 
Oh boy. Page of Cups in reversed and the world in reversed. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh my air sign friends. Lack of communication or not answering communication and something coming back around. A cycle that did not quite complete coming back around. There's the return right there. All right. Why is the five of pentacles here? Real quick. Hi. Eight of Wands reversed. There was, there was that, that's a ghosting. Sudden change, complete cut off in communication. Somebody went ghost. Could have been you. Could have been the person you were dealing with. That's how you leave something hanging out there. Oh yeah. <laughs> when you never give or get an explanation, that that's a recipe for leaving something hanging there. Could have been the person you were dealing with because you were just kind of standing at the crossroads. Um, what do I do? Why is the two of wands reversed here? You gave me four. I'm putting them back in. Just want one. Just give me one. Ace of Cups reversed. Left standing there not knowing. Left standing there not knowing what happened. Why it didn't take off. We waited it out. Oh boy. Why is Page Cups here? Judgment reversed. So you finally release it. Finally say, you know what? I I'm done. It's not coming back. Then judgment's reversed. And the world is reversed. And something returns. Air signs. This is how the universe works. The second you finally say, okay, I'm done. It comes back. Yep. Well, air signs. Let's get your advice. Four of Wands reversed, Seven of Swords. With this return, if something seems even a little bit shady. It may benefit you to keep the door closed because the dust still hasn't settled from that tower. Oh, it gave me three. Eight of Cups, Ace of Swords. There's new communication with new people. Ace of Swords coming around. Eight of Cups. It may be time to move on. You need to walk your path and take care of yourself. Because there's new things coming for you. This is the path of self-love. Okay? Okay. This is the path to emotional fulfillment. This is the eight cups before the ninth. You need to fill that cup that got spilled. Keep that in mind. Okay, air signs. <laughs> I think we're going to do one more. 
because that one popped out. Queen of Cups and the Two of Swords. Yep. You're going to be faced with a very difficult decision. But ultimately, you need to love yourself first and foremost with this Queen of Cups. Love yourself first, air signs. They put you through it. But it's up to you what you do with it. Okay. Water signs. Kent, Pisces, Scorpio. It's coming in for you guys this week. I do that now, just so we know where we're at. King of Wands and the Strength Reversed. Oh my. <clears throat> King of Wands talks about action, also talks about passion. This week may be a little bit draining. All that go, go, go. This week you might be saying on no, no, no. Run it out of steam, possibly. We have justice in the page of wands in the past. Could have been a Libra you're dealing with. I also have Leo. And any other fire sign. Okay particularly Aries or Sagittarius. They're all here, so let's just call it any fire sign. <sighs> Could have been a legal matter you're dealing with. Things were level. Hmm. Throw a clarifier on that in a minute. Fast forward. The Knight of Wands and the Ace of Wands. Good Lord, there's a lot of wands on this table. Could have been dealing with a player. Someone in and out of your life. I mean, when they were in, they were in. So you just get that match struck and then they'd go. The striking match of the Ace of Wands has a tendency to burn out quick. Drained. All right, what's coming in for this week? The Eight of Cups and the High Priestess in Reverse. Okay. Moving on. Imbalanced Connection. Why is Justice here? Why is justice here? Sun reversed. Someone wasn't happy. Could have been a legal matter that didn't quite turn out in your favor. 
or false happiness. You could have been equally unhappy. Which led to the legal matter. Alright. Why is the Ace of Wands here? Five of Swords reversed. In and out, non committal energy. Constantly leaving, leaving the pieces when they went. It was hard to make anything come of it. You couldn't get to that moment of victory with this person because every time you came out of the state of heartbreak and you laid it to rest, they'd return and then just leave it in a shambles again. But this coming week, Eight of Cups, High Priestess reversed. Why is the High Priestess reversed here? Thank you, Eight of Wands. Eight of Cups, High Priestess reversed, Eight of Wands. You are acknowledging this connection is never going to come back together. It's always going to be there, but you're never going to be on the same plane. I think this week you're going to get an opportunity to communicate that, possibly in a pretty fiery way. So I'd, yeah. And you're going to move forward. You're going to move forward to find, we were just talking about this with the air signs, to find your ninth cup of emotional fulfillment because you're not happy here. And you're going to do it very quickly and abruptly. Let's get your advice. You're done being drained. I don't blame you. Three of Wands reversed. Judgment reversed. You ever hear the phrase, just go before I change my mind? This is kind of where you're going to be at this week. And this may be kind of where you need to stay. Just go before I change my mind. Don't wait around. If you're going to do it, do it. And don't be wishy-washy about it. Seven of Swords reversed and the Six of Pentacles in the upright. Be honest and be fair. Allow balance to restore. Enough of the shady stuff. Page of Pentacles in the reversed and the Ace of Swords. Mm -hmm. If they start throwing offers at you, think it through. But I think you have something new coming for you, potentially with an air sign. I would just think before you act and just kind of let this grind to halt. Okay. Water signs. That's what I have for you. Oh, my fire sign friends. What do we have for my fire sign friends this week? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. My brain's waking up. I'm always so happy when Tuesday gets here. Always so happy. Tomorrow's no alarm Tuesday. Oh man, Queen of Cups reverse, King of Cups in the upright. <clears throat> I 
You're feeling it, but you ain't showing it. Hmm. Oh, my fire sign friends. What have you gotten yourself into now? In the past, we have the Judgment reversed and the Four of Cups in the uprights. Possibly there was a return. Possibly. Reversal of Judgment, anyway. But you spent so much time concentrating on the Three Spilt Cups of the past, you didn't notice that the universe was trying to hand you something. You didn't see it. Your back was turned to an offer. You didn't see it. Page of Cups in the reverse. The Eight of Cups in the reverse. <sighs> messages not getting through or messages being ignored. Is someone attempts to make a return or you attempt to make a return? <coughs> Someone's trying to express it and someone else is completely closed off to it. Okay. Hmm. Oh my, Ace of Cups and the Five of Pentacles reversed. We're going to throw a clarifier in that Five of Pentacles reversed. Um, I think this week somebody's going to try it again. I'm going to give you this cup of newness one last time. Why is the Five of Pentacles reversed here? Hi! Seven of Swords. They're going to come back with truth. Why is the Ace of Cups reversed here? Swords. Oh, wow. Eight of Swords. This is going to mess somebody up. Either this is going to mess you up, or the person you're dealing with has been messed up about this for a while. They want to come back with truth. They want to come back with honesty. Wow. Let's back up a little bit. Why is that Eight of Cups here? Why is the Eight of Cups reversed here? It's going to back up just a little bit. Five of Wands. <sighs> Blocked communication. Messages not getting through or messages being ignored. When you did finally come face to face, it may have been a little bit confrontational. I don't, may not have been openly confrontational. Like one of you could have said something and the other person's just, it's like a powder keg thing. Fire signs. We're so good at that. We either go off or we store it up. I think you stored it up. And that's why communication continued to be blocked. And this week, things come to a head. Somebody's coming back with truth. Someone's going to be a little bit consumed. Can I get one more to couple these up, please? I'm going to fill in this gap, then we'll get fire sign advice. One more on this, please. Hi. Six of Pentacles, evening the score. 
leveling things out. Truth be spoken. Leveling the playing field. Oh, wow. Somebody's feeling it. Somebody's completely closed off. It's like a switch, isn't it, fire signs? It's like a switch. All right, let's get your advice. King of Swords reverse, Two of Pentacles in the reverse. Be nice. Maintain a positive attitude. Don't make emotion-based decisions. Try, try to be logical when and if this comes about. And don't let it throw you into, into a state of emotional juggling, which it's probably going to. Try not to let that happen. Don't let it throw you off. The world reverses Six of Swords. This return is happening because there was no closure. For some of you, this is going to happen to possibly finally close this cycle out. And the longer you maintain this, I don't want to deal with it attitude, the longer you put it off, the longer it's going to take. Does that make sense? You have to let the cycle close itself out. You may just have to have the conversation. Or you never get to close this out. So if the opportunity comes to at least close it out so you can be done with it, just let let it close. Don't ignore it forever. Knight of Wands reversed in the Four of Wands in the upright. Oh wow. Oh wow. You may be coming back. Reading. What? Hmm. Give me five minutes. Okay, give me five minutes. I love you. Gosh, she's up early. What? He's a kid. School's over with, like, officially. Why is he up? All right. Four of Wands, Knight of Wands in the reverse. Whoever's coming back, they're not playing games. They may legitimately want to rebuild with you. And if that's what you want, the door may be open for some of you. And it's your decision whether you want to walk through the open door or not. That's what I have for you, fire sign friends. Don't stay closed off to it. Let whatever's going to happen, happen. Let whatever will be, will be. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Earth sign friends. Four of Swords and the Prince of Cups. Finally laying something to rest. And <laughs> here comes non-committal Joe with his cup of love. Isn't that beautiful? All right, well. Four of Wands in the upright, Devil in the reverse. <clears throat> Stability. Disconnecting from toxic things that don't serve you, didn't serve you. Disconnecting from a powerful connection. K 
King of Swords reversed, Ten of Cups reversed. Oh boy. Somebody didn't have a so rosy attitude. Somebody wasn't happy. Sun reversed, King of Cups. That's interesting. The Prince to the King. That powerful connection that you tried to disconnect from still there and this week may need to be acknowledged why is the king of cups here three of wands maybe you're waiting maybe they're waiting Temperance reversed. But the energy flow just still isn't positive. It's still not there. Why is the sun here? Thanks. Four of cups reversed. Straight up ignoring the damn cup. Earth signs, whoever, whatever this was, you've laid it to rest. And I don't think you care what's in the cup this week. Because you're done. I think you worked so hard trying to disconnect from whatever this was and you have such a terrible attitude toward it. The very idea of it just makes you cringe. If they come back this week, you don't care what's in the cup because you're over it. That's what I'm thinking. You released it. You've laid it to rest. They can't say or do anything to make this come back around for you this week. Because you're just over it. Your advice, the Prince of Pentacles, upright, the tower reversed. Oh my. They may come back in with a stunning offer, and it is up to you whether you want to rebuild this tower or not. If you just want to leave it laying there on the ground. Remember, it was your tower, too. The Queen of Cups and the Five of Pentacles reversed. There's the Queen. I got a Prince, a Queen, and a King. Love yourself first. That does not... That doesn't mean you're being selfish. It means you love yourself enough to not want to put yourself through this again. I'm guessing this was pretty bad if this devil's up here. And I'm guessing it, it affected your attitude with this King of Swords reversed down here. You gotta love yourself first. Five of Cups reversed and Justice reversed. Do not allow this to suck you back into a state of sadness and throw you off balance. Stay the course. You're doing well. You're laying it to rest. Don't let uncommittal Joe mess with you that bad this week, okay? All right, that's what I have for you guys. All right, know that you loved, be blessed, and hopefully I'm not too tired tonight when I get home, because I got some cards to read over the next couple of days to get this cycle done, because I'm already behind again. All right. Take care, loves. Have a wonderful week. I will catch all of you on Friday.